How's it hanging everybody? Welcome back to another video. The official trailer just dropped for M. Night Shyamalan's upcoming film, Old. In this video, I will be re-watching the trailer in slow motion, looking for clues and speculating on just what exactly is going on in this film and what the potential twists might be. If this is your first time here, my name is Randy and I make fun, creative content with horror movies. So if that sounds like something you're into, consider subscribing. In the beginning dialogue, the father says that kids are not allowed on the beach. I mean, he's just joking, but he is reading off of a, a booklet, so I wonder if that plays any factor into the beach itself. Now, I don't know who this girl is in the corner here. This is not the sister, because the sister does not have this jacket, and the sister was wearing a hat, as we can see right here, along with a rainbow-colored shirt here. So I don't know who this character is. And I wonder if M. Night casted this child actor because she looks like the sister. So I wonder if that's going to play into the twist in the future. The dialogue between the son and the mother is a very important tell. The son mentions that the mom said they would get there in five minutes, but to the son, it's been a much longer than that, which is exactly what's going to happen later on in the film. So it looks like the family came in with another group don't know if they're friends, but later on in the trailer, it sort of gives you clues as to if they know these people or not. Another confirmation, as you can see in the bottom left corner here, the little girl in pink is actually a part of this group and not a part of the main family. I have a prediction about this girl. My prediction is since she's the youngest best looking one, she's going to have the worst fate. She's going to end up aging more rapidly than any other character in this film and will end up looking very, very old. Just a prediction. So the kids stumble upon a pile of stuff from other travelers who have probably died here. Now the shatter on the glass here makes me think that objects also age, but later on in the trailer you'll see why objects don't age and only organic things age. So first hint of objects not aging are these phones. I mean you can't tell if they turn on and still work, but from the looks of it nothing has been rusted or malfunctioning, so a clue as to if objects age or not. So this is why I think these groups don't know each other. You see how far they are? from each other. I think if they are friends or if they knew each other, they would be a lot closer, don't you think? Here's the first shot of the dead woman that the kids find. Pay attention to her necklace. So this is the part where they find out that the dead woman has decomposed already, which the mother later explains that it takes seven years to do. And as you can see in the top right corner here, this is the necklace that she was wearing, which didn't age, didn't rust, nothing happened. So I can conclude that objects don't age in this place. So this shot of the ants running around in a line makes me think that nature had something to do with this aging process. There are also certain species that live longer than humans, and I'm thinking that the aging process might have accelerated their intelligence, and maybe that's having to do with the decomposition of the dead woman. So here is the sister who's also grown up. It looks like she's now younger than the brother, but I'll save that thought for later. So the little girl in pink was six, but she's now just as old or older than the other two kids. So I think this can be confirmed that whatever's happening has a different effect on different people. Some age much quicker than others and others age much slower than others. All right, we got to figure out who the hell slept with this girl. I think this is one of the big twists in the film of who did it. I'm also thinking this person had something to do with the aging process. 
My biggest suspect of who could be doing this, if it is a human, is this guy. This scene in the trailer, they are suspecting that he has something to do with it, which he vehemently denies. But we do see him in this shot being super close to this little girl who he should have no relationship with, which makes me suspect him. But it's just speculation for now. So they try to come back the way they came and something is preventing them from leaving. It could be supernatural, it could be alien, which later on in the trailer, there is something sort of alien. So this is the part where I feel like aliens could be involved. The son and the daughter finds this message that's written by either aliens or people who were previously on this beach. If anybody can decode this in the comment section down below, kudos to you because I cannot figure it out. So that's it for the trailer. Hope you guys liked it. I am pretty excited for this film to come out. If you like this video, do me a big favor and click like and I'll catch you guys next time.